Welcome back to another video, Izzy here and today I thought I would do a simple drugstore makeup routine. I was just messing about with some makeup um, earlier and I thought I'd put this together. I personally, I don't wear like makeup to school very often because I don't wake up early enough to wear makeup. So I don't always have time because I just like go along with it really slowly and then I'm like oh my gosh I'm late because I've put makeup on. If I was going to wear makeup to school I would probably wear this. Obviously you don't have to do like as much as I did. It's just for those of you that want a little bit more coverage, want that little bit more makeup. I decided to do this eye look because my school personally allows makeup like this. I know some schools may not allow makeup are only allowed like really natural makeup. If you enjoy it, if you do, don't forget to give it a massive thumbs up as well as subscribe to the channel. I know if you actually did like this makeup look and you'd like me to do more of these like simple drugstore makeup looks, because I'd definitely be up for doing that. Also, all my social medias will be on the screen or down below. Don't forget to go and check them out and go and follow me over on there. And also on my Instagram, I'm doing this thing where every Friday I choose an edit which you guys have made. Uh, I'm going to choose one and feature it on my Instagram page. So if you'd like to be involved with that, then head over to my Instagram and check me out and follow me. And yeah, without further ado, let's get straight into this video. I'm going to start by moisturising my face with the Aveeno Skin Relief Moisturiser, just as a light base for underneath my BB cream. And for primer, obviously I'm using the Baby Skin in Cool Rose Grey Primer. Talk about it all the time. I've just dampened my beauty blender by Real Techniques and I'm going to be taking the Maybelline Dream Fresh BB Cream and this is in the light shade and I'm just going to bounce my beauty blender up and down on my face just to get a clean blended complexion on my face. For my eyes I'm going to be using the W7 palette and I'm going to be taking this first shade which is like a silvery white shade just to make my eyes look a little bit brighter and just blending that all over my lid. I'm then taking this more champagne, like goldy colour, just to add a little bit of definition into my crease. I do go back and clean this up a little bit. And then I just use my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Concealer and just do a little triangle underneath my eye and use the tip of the sponge and bounce it in with the sponge. And brows are super simple, I just brush them through with a spoolie and then brush through some product using the Brow Drama in the shade Dark Blonde. For mascara I use the Colossal Go Extreme Mascara just to make my eyelashes look really fluttery. I then did my other eye off camera just to save a bit of time in this video and then I use the Rimmel Blush in the shade Pink Rose just to add a bit of colour to my cheeks. I then added some highlight, I used the Soap and Glory Glow It All Out highlight. Obviously you don't have to do this but I just decided to to make my skin look a little bit more fresh and glowy and make myself look a little bit more alive for school. Now to powder my face I just used the Maybelline Matte Maker Powder and also this like, So Eco brush. I'm not sure what it's really for but I just decided to use it for powder because why not? For lips, I just went for something really natural and just dabbed some of the Kate Moss lipstick in the shade 38, just to add a little bit of colour to my lips, and that is the makeup look done. enjoyed that overall makeup look and if you did don't forget to give it a massive thumbs up as well as subscribe to the channel also any of my social medias will be on the screen or down below and if you want to use any of the products or go and buy them yourself they'll be linked down below as well and i love you all so much and i'll see you all very very soon bye